Jack Blankenship just got done uh, Coastal Nationals title. Congratulations. So tell me about your tournament. Um, I started off, uh, went through the quarters, four pins, and had a 1 0 match. The semis and the 5 2 match now. Oh, I missed your semi. I saw you, I saw you kind of running through the beginning of the tournament. Some awesome double legs going feet to back. Man, they look really cool. Thank you. Uh, so tell me about your semi. Who are you wrestling there? Um, Vincent Robinson yeah. out of a. Uh, uh, I'm not even sure where. Really solid on his feet. Got that one from like escape. That that now scored the whole time. Nice. And that guy in the finals, man, he wrestled you hard. I noticed, you know, you, you're really good at staying in position. He was attacking, clubbing, and hitting those like knee pulls. How do you stay? How do you stay uh, comfortable and, and in good position when guys attacking you like that? Uh, I try to stay calm. Um, I know what I'm doing most of the time, so I just have confidence in that, and I just Twelve hundred one hundred five pounds. What's it like, you know, if we look at your like first three or four matches and you're kind of dominating there, and then you have to you have to be in these really tight matches. Is anything different? Like, is anything in your head different? Um, not in my head. I go in the same way every time. I'm going out there, just trying my best, no matter who it is. But I get a little more tired on those close matches. Yeah, yeah, of course. Um, talk about your training. You know, what are you doing on a day-to-day -day basis to give you success? At, at tough events like this? Um, uh, with my school, I lift in the morning, and then after practice, or after school, we go practice for two and a half hours. Yeah. That's, I do that Monday through Friday usually. Tell me a little bit about raw, about raw wrestling. Um, I've been with it since I was in like third grade. Shane's my mentor. I'm, he, I owe my success to him. He's been a great coach and I'm glad for raw. What would you say to uh, to a little kid that's looking at you and thinking that he wants to to be successful at events like this? Uh, just stick with it, push through the tournaments you lose, win or lose, just keep going and you'll eventually have success to work hard enough. Nice. What are you looking to do with wrestling this year and then in the next few years? Um, I hope to win state this year as a freshman and be a four timer, hopefully, and that'll lead to more success. Nice. That's tough to do in Oklahoma. Congratulations, I had a really uh, fun time watching you this weekend. You got anything else to say? Uh, no, I do not.